Hey guys, what's up? It is Lena here. And you probably already know that, but I am doing a review for the second annual MTV Fandom Awards. Hosted by Bella Thorne. And an actress, she's a singer, she's a dancer, she did everything. She was appearing on MTV Scream. And then Tyler Posey, who was on MTV show Teen Wolf, they hosted the show, and the show was really good, and I actually pretty liked it. Um, they had we had performers, we had the it's, it's about the face the fandom war is about the fans. You know how the you know how if you I don't know if you if you guys are on Tumblr, you, most of you ever probably are. That was a stupid question to ask, but you know you have fan fiction. You know when you have like um uh, Elicity from Arrow or like the Vampire Diaries, Team Bayman, or like the um or like the the ship when you ship somebody. You know, when you like shipping somebody, like, you know, relationship, when you put two characters' names together, that's how, that's what the fandom was about. And the fans got to vote, and I voted too, and, um, people, they won, a lot of, uh, people won, I don't know if, like, some, some other fandoms may be a little bit upset about that they won, but... It was a great show, and let's just say I love Bella Thorne's two outfits. She looked amazing. Austin Butler, oh my god, Austin Butler, his hair looked amazing. He presented, he got a new MT uh, series that's gonna come out, it's called The Shannara Chronicles. But um, he presented Best New Fandom of the Year Award, and um, I like how when they when they show the nominees, celebrities actually talk about the show a little bit in some short clips, and if they like the show and how they like it and stuff, and how they like the show and stuff. So he did like Empire, like Empire was nominated for this award, and Selena Gomez talking about how she liked it and stuff. And he had other you know internet sensations talking about they liked it. I'm like, I think it's a really cool award show. I missed last year, but this year was pretty cool. So um, the winner for that was I Zombie, the CW show. They won. For best new fan of the year, works there a new show and they got moved for season two. So congrats to Aaron I Zombie, Tasha Leggero, and Taryn Killam. They presented the Feels Freak Out of the Year, which is like basically whatever you freaked out about the whole year. You know, Zan leaving One Direction and all that, um, or when Nina the Red the Vampire Diaries, and they made some joke about Justin Bieber's butt that he just posted on Instagram and the College and the Lip Challenge that everyone was doing that was making their lips really big. That one was Pretty Little Liars, Who is Charles? Because all of a sudden, Charles, this character named Charles came out of the blue nowhere on this Pretty Little Liars show. I still haven't watched it. I've caught some episodes of it, but I'm tired. Is it A back? I don't know. I gotta catch up on it somehow on Netflix, but it's still coming on. Like, Jesus, it's been five years. I'm literally so confused on that show. I would have Orange is New Black on his underwear because they was um, showing the nominees for Fandom of the Year award, and he had he pulled down and he won that Orange is New Black was a nominee. Unfortunately, they did not win. Um, I was pretty upset because I love that show. I watch, I watch the show on Netflix, so it's a pretty good show. Um, can't wait for the next season. Um, but All Time Low performed. Um, they dance was really cool. They sound remind me of a, like an early 2000s rock song. I can't think of what the lead guys sound like, but he, this, it was a really cool performance, and they dance was really cool. I already said before, yes to Bella's Scream outfit. Greenwood and Atlanta Jones presented the Ship of the Year. Award winner, the the winner, it had over 28 million votes from Tumblr. It was Elicity uh, from Arrow on the CW. It's the two characters, Oliver and Felicity, and they won together, so congratulations to them. Uh, Greg, Greg Sokin was up there. They was presenting presenting because they was doing the show exclusive clip to um, Paul Rudd's new movie, Ant-Man, for Marvel's new movie. And, oh my god, Greg was like, isn't it kind of weird how random, how they pair us together? And she's like, oh, I don't think so. And it's like, Huggin' Oski knows rumored that they together because they didn't even post pictures of each other. They were from the girl, basically. They didn't have to really say or nothing. We already know. Okay, we know. Yes to, I don't know their ship name, but I'm thinking one. Grella, Grella, or Bet Brig. That's a good one. That's a good one. So, um... They look so cute together. Uh, Phantom Army of the Year when it was the Harmonizers, Fifth Harmony's fans. They won. Congratulations to them. I see a lot of them on Tumblr doing the fan fiction stuff, and that's really cool. They did a memorial of all the characters that have been killed off, off the, of the show. You know, they had a lot from uh, McDreamy on Grey's Anatomy to Vampire Diaries when Nino Dobrev's character um, got killed off to uh, a lot of other shows. And in the memorial, rest in peace. I don't like it when a character gets killed off. Oh my god, I'm so, I don't know. They played Rihanna's Day too. Fan of the Year, the person who won Fan of the Year, they did the top pick four picks. It was Teen Wolf, Orange is New Black, you know, the Kardashians, and The Hunger Games, Mocking J Part 1. The winner was The Hunger Games, Mocking J Part 1. Like I said before, I was sad that Orange is New Black didn't win, but I did love The Hunger Games movie. And Willow Shields came out and she accepted the award because she played Primrose Everdeen. And that was really cool. You know, I love that movie. And I cannot wait for Part 2. Oh my God, Part 2 is seriously what the heck is going to happen. I do not know. 
Let's get back to the thing. Now B came on. She presented a fluorescent performance. I loved her dress. It was so pretty um, and so edgy. She, um, fluoride performed it. Oh my God, she performed. It's going down for real. Going down for real. GDFR. And Bella Thorne was dancing so hard. And he took his shirt off. I was like, no, thank you. But, you know, he can do what he wants. It's his performance. So. Um, the dancers was doing a really good job. Uh, they were shaking their butt and stuff. And so Bellathon was really happy about Flo Rida before. She was like, yes, she loved Flo Rida. And she was screaming. And Tyler came up and scared her because he had the screen, screen max on. And it was really funny. And he's really weird, but he's really cool at the same time. I like him. Pretty much it, guys, um, for this whole award show. It was only an hour, but it was really cool. And I like how he had let the fans, you know, vote and stuff. You know, let them vote, you know, because they, they take this really seriously on the internet. But um, thanks for watching the review. Like, share, subscribe, and comment this video. Send my email. Send every to uh, Bella Thorne and Tyler Posey and MTV. And if the fan wants to get a Twitter, send them too. It's going to be in the description below. Follow me on all social media in the description below. And like I said before, this is a pretty cool award show. This is the first time I've seen it. This is the second annual 2015 MTV Fan Awards. And I love how they, you know, give show that we show that us fans on the, in these shows that we make fandoms and ships out of anything and anybody that we love and that we truly love because this is the fandom awards and i like how they this is i just i just like i like how they show it you know because and how they support and how they you know give love to the fans and all that because it's this is a very serious situation when they do it oh my god these fan fictions on tumblr they be so much but let me just stop blabbering Thanks for watching this view, and um, I'll probably, I'll, well, I don't know if I'll see you next year, but I might, I might see you, I might not, but most likely I'll probably, I might, well, you know, I don't know, I don't know, but uh, bye guys. Oh wait, check my outfit. Okay, now.